M0FXP, welcome to my channel. Someone asked me about the DV Stick Mega and said, do I think they're any good? Well, there's a quick answer and that is, yeah, I think they're very good. They plug into your PC, they're only small. They get you on DMRD Star Fusion. They're 90 pound plus six delivery. Uh, Martin Lynch have got them and they get you on all the modes. You use the microphone and the speaker that's in the computer or laptop. Uh, there's a quick, you know, showing you how to configuration down here. Now I've got a Blue DV system, although it's not the Blue DV stick, but it's it uses a very similar system. So I'm going to fire that up for you here. Here's mine and it looks the same. Now yours in the settings will be different. So first thing you need to do is download the software from Blue DV. So I'll put the link in the description. It's by PA7LIM, does some really great work. This is obviously what it, what it looks like the software. So download that. Let's open up Blue DV again. So once you've downloaded it, you're going to get this kind of window. You need to find what you when you've plugged it into the PC, you need to find the port. So go to device manager and double click port. And look, I'm on serial comp eight here. Then before you connect, I would say, let's do an update. So click these update buttons here update all of these, just click them all one at a time. I'll just do one for now because I've already done it, you see. Okay, but you can see it's DMRD Star Fusion up and the core, core database. You've got some about information here as well. So let's go into the main menu setup. So what you do, once you go into that, you're gonna see something similar to this. Now remember, you're using Thumb DV Stick, so you, you select that there. I'm actually not using that, but it doesn't matter. Same, very similar setup. Core sign, we know it's COM8, we just saw that. Uh, frequency only matters if you're using a hotspot, we're not. You've got location if you want that. Now, here on the D star section, you can type in where you want to go. I've got reflector 30C, module C here, look. APRS I've turned on, and enable at start just means that as soon as you turn on, it will log in uh, to reflector 30. And then DMR wise, you need a DMR number in here. And you can choose which server you're going to use. There's a few here. And it does change. So if you go to, let's try BM. You've got your drop down there. Look, if we go to DMR Plus, drop down there. So I tend to use Brandmeister. You need your self care password in here. Go to Brandmeister and get that. I'll show you how to do that. So go here to this address, I put the link in, create yourself an account, go to Brand Maestro, and when you're in settings, click your username. Oh, I've got need to log in by the looks of it. Oh, that's good, it remembered my password. So click your username here, and if it go to self-care, and then you need to just create a password. See here, it says hotspot security. Put in, let's say you put in, um, my password is ham radio. Click save, and then ham radio is now your self-care password so let's go back to the app go back into the menu setup and just in case that wasn't on the page look m0 fxb no need to do frequency location deflect the 30 uh, enable at start is here so dmr number there's all your drop down things for dmr self-care password just showed you that master choose the one you like uh, and then for Fusion, it's got your location there. Um, let's have a look here. YSF or FCS, choose the one you like. Again, you can enable at the start. Um, now, Ambi, the Ambi stick, you want to select that. I've already shown you that. Ignore the IP address, that's for hotspot. And I think that's it. So if we click OK, save now. Now, when you're on Ambi, now I can't properly do this but go to ambi here now when you click serial on and then click dmr let's say it won't let me do it because i haven't got the ambi stick here but if it did slide over you could just literally type in your dmr number and you can either use the space bar on your computer or you can just uh you know click this this here and it will ptt on uh on, on Ambi, and you get last heard info and BM. Now, I can log in on my other system, so we'll, we'll, I'll show you the one I've got. Let's turn that off, go menu, setup, 
Mine is a DV Mega, which isn't Thumb DV. So we just unclick that, leave that alone. Then we should be able to log back in now, save. And I should be able to log in on mine now. Yeah, we do it on Fusion. And then we'll, s mine will actually transmit to a radio. You're going to be on a PC, aren't you? So 431550, and it says Fusion here, and let's link. Link to CQ UK. Let's see if we can, uh, we'll try and get a contact. So we're going to uh, TX and see if, when it TXs, it goes red. And when it receives, it goes green. Ah, oh, there's someone there. Just quickly keyed up. M0FXB calling for a contact. Mike Zero, Fox X-Ray, Bravo. Oh, briefly came in. Can you see we've got history here? Mike Zero, Fox X-Ray, Bravo. There you go, and it sounds excellent. And you'll be talking on your PC. Uh, I'll show you how to do to select your different devices on your PC as well. M zero FXB returning. Yeah, just a quick audio check, really. How am I sounding? It's Andreas, Southwest UK. Yeah, we're certainly making uh, the trip into uh, North East Wales. My name is uh, Stephen, and uh, you uh, no problem at all on the audio. I know uh, the VK uh, station on, and he was rather distorted, uh, but uh, you're uh, clear and green. Uh, two Whiskey Zero, Japan, Yankee, November. Always friendly on CQ UK. Obviously, there's lots of places you can connect. Look at the drop down list, there's loads. So, Oh, thanks very much. Yeah, I'll stand by just in the middle of doing some tests here. But really nice of you to come back to me. I'm only in Western Supermare. So 7-3, all the best. There you go. So we just... Yeah, we're 7-3. And uh, hopefully you uh, catch you further down the road. Uh, two whiskey zero, Japan, Yankee, November. And, uh... There you go. Thanks very much. So now we'll go to... Menu again. We've un we've unlinked here. Setup. I'm going to retick the thumb the thumb DV stick. I'm going to click OK. So I'm hoping it shows me how to set the microphone here. Now normally you'd be able to hear. I I can do. I have got a microphone H2N plugged in, and go here. Speakers on my computer, which is going to be that one there. That's great. So I've got that selected, but the only problem is I haven't got a, a DV stick. But oh, that's the only thing that I can see that's different uh, about the whole setup here. So thanks for watching my channel. I think this is a great device. I think it's very inexpensive. You can get a second hand one of these for say sixty pound, uh, sixty seventy pound. You've done really well. You won't need a hotspot. The, you know the one thing is that it's definitely not. Um, you know it's not a radio. You're using your PC laptop. Um, I'm just looking at other settings here. Let's go back into the menu just quickly. Set up. And notice that it has got an option here for IP addresses. So it's an ambi server. So I'm guessing that's almost like a hotspot, isn't it? It's like sits there on your desk and, and it communicates with the same software, uh, ambi server. Uh, works in the same way, but it's using like a hotspot. Uh, but it's not an MMDVM hotspot. It's like a Raspberry Pi with the server built into it. That's my guess. Um, what else we got here that we could select? No, and the serial port uh, that you probably have to select the serial port for your Ambi stick. You probably have to select it. I would say here. Otherwise, it's the same. So seven three. Thanks for watching. Martin Lynch has got these. If you're interested, it's quite. I think it's actually a very fair price that they're charging. Uh, I'm not selling for them. It's just that I do think it's a fair price. Um, so we just minimise that. Go to the top. Yeah, there they are. I think that's a good price. Gets you on all modes. All you need is a ham radio license. 7-3, all the best.